Hi there, and thank you very much for following our channel. So in this video, we would like to introduce a new playlist that we're preparing related to practical turbulence modeling. Uh, and in this case, we'll be using ANSYS Fluent, but we are also extending this playlist to do it using OpenFun so we can compare OpenFun and Fluent just to show you how to set up cases. But what is more important that turbulence modeling is, is general the theory. So it doesn't matter what software you use, if you follow good standard practices, you should obtain uh, exactly the same results. So this is our goal. So as you visit our YouTube page, you will find here now uh, playlist, okay? And here we have this playlist, which is practical turbulence modeling with ANSYS Fluent. So for the moment, now we have a few videos, but the list is keep, keep increasing. So after, after today, we have this many videos, but we're going to add more videos to cover more complex physics. So the tutorials, the videos that you are here are just short how to two videos how to show you uh how to set up cases how to choose right boundary conditions how to do post processing basic advanced post processing and so on we are not going to cover geometry generation mesh generation okay except for the two fir the first two tutorials that we show a little bit that but for our proposals we are going to give you all the meshes pre manufactured okay so just to show you that is you visit is you know, the videos you will have here in the comment section now a few comments now the link where you can download the tutorial so each of these videos you have the link you can download all the cases are ready to run okay so you can set up that for a scratch or you just can use the pre manufacturer solution and see how we set up everything so to run all these cases you need a analysis uh, version and just to point out that this course is based you now in a in a Torrance modeling course that we deliver in the University of Genoa. So for that we use ANSYS student version. Okay, so you can download that version. So the latest download as of today is the 2023. Uh, these videos were prepared using 2021, but it should be compatible. There is there are problems, there are small differences that I guess you should be able to fix. But the mesh and basic case so that shouldn't be a problem. And just to point out, uh, point out that the videos are based in this uh, <clears throat> in this academic course that we have here, the link. So as you see, I, we're not going to talk about the lectures. As I say, the videos are just how to how to videos just to show how to set up. But if you are curious here, you have extensive lectures, all the theory behind turbulence modeling. So here we are going to focus just in these tutorials that we have in the, with, with this web page, but have in mind that we're going to add more tutorials different from this case. So these cases that we have here, you may guess that this student version has a limitation. So all these cases that we're going to do, the one that we, you have in the web page and the ones that we're going to allow, they will run it with the student version that was the limitation, with the cell limit limitation. And when we use larger cache cases, we're going to, to mention that. But to stress that all these cases, we can you can run in your computer, okay? So we're going to do 2D cases and 3D cases, scale resolving simulation, less the simulations and so on. Also to mention that if you want to address basic fluent use, here you have also some basic tutorials that later also we're going to create a new playlist in our YouTube channel so you can follow that. So basically this is the, what we want to mention, this short introduction. Also just to end, uh, to mention that the directory structure when you download the case that we have linked here is dependent on the case, but in every single case you're going to find a file called case presentation where we introduce the case. No? So these are basic so PDF and we give some reference, we show geometry. So a basic introduction and then we show some results that you can reproduce. So in our videos, we are going to see how to set up exactly the same. This is probably you are familiar with this. If you are from now, as you have done torrents modeling, you haven't done torrents modeling, you are going to get familiar with this very important plot. So we're going to see how to do all the, these plots. Also, you will find, depending on the case, no different files. So see here that you have the fluent case. 
okay so it is compressed so in this file is you open you will find the <coughs> the fluent case ready to run okay so you have the files there and any other additional file okay you also so this is ready to run also you have the clean meshes okay so you can open the mesh no case setup so you can follow the video instructions and try to set up the case at your own okay and sometimes you will also find the setting file so this setting file is to automatically set up the case using the meshes so whether it's that in the videos um from time to time also you're going to find the workbench case so this is the workbench the videos we show how to run using workbench and fluent standalone so if you find this one you have the workbench so you're like likely you're going to find here now geometry generation case para parameterization and so on. but most of the cases is just fluent standalone stand alone the stand alone this these files and sometimes you can have here some support files that can be papers or some solutions all the results okay so this is a structure you can download all the cases and basically that's what you're going to find so yep this is all for this introduction as we mentioned now the list of videos are going to increase in time so now we have a very limited list but we hope to add more and more videos and also add or try to add the comparison also with with open phone so all these cases also compare with open phone and just to show, show differences plus also we're planning to add the general uses videos for for ansys and ansys fluent and ansys workbench so this is all for this introduction of these new videos that we have developed if you have any questions or comments just please do not hesitate in sending sending an email or just adding a comment here. So probably when we check, we can answer that. So thank you very much and hope to see you soon. Bye.